for this 160th anniversary of the Southside Presbyterian Church. And um, the pipe organ was added in 1893. They started doing the foundation in 1860, uh, and there is some speculation, some rumor that uh, it was used as part of the Underground Railroad, but um, uh, we've not seen anything in writing about that, so it's, um, that's a mystery. Yes, that is our, that is our church's motto, uh, transforming, not conforming. And that, that actually is, um, comes from a quote from the Bible, from, um, uh, the early Christian Paul, um, where he, he says, um, be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your minds. I mean, if we have a building, I think it is, it needs to be used. Otherwise, you shouldn't have it. <laughs> a part of our role as a church has been in the community has been to, you know, welcome the diverse people who move here, uh, who have long, lived here a long time, try to work for um, uh, good relationships among all the people for it's a kind of peacemaking. Um, our co-creators youth club, which is a weeknight program for, it's now for ages four to 16. We have a preschool, we have, um, the Coffee House, which uh, is an evening program once a month that encourages people in the arts, the food pantry, clothing pantry, uh, AA meets here, several groups of AA, Al-Anon, al, -Anon, al -Teen. Uh, there's a dance group that meets here, there's a, um, an after-school program uh, which is full day uh, in the summer to serving God and serving the people in this neighborhood, who, whoever they are. Truly, God knows, you know, what the future holds. For.